what would you consider the rule of thumb for an educator or a school admin or a district or whatever in selecting a virtual learning uh, environment? What would you consider now in just like one minute, 60 seconds, what would you consider for that? Ease of access. Uh, and for me, um, ease of access is key. So if I'm a district, if I need to monitor, I need to see what's going on, I need to uh, have a um, analytic view of engagement and all that. I, I need something that would help me do that easily. So for me, ease of access is, is key. Yeah, okay, so Karen? I, I agree, ease of access and um, what, you, what the teacher feels most comfortable teaching with you know the tool that you feel most comfortable the students are going to pick that up from you um, if you are very nervous which is okay many times we are when we try something new if you're very nervous the students will pick that up but uh, that's okay too you just explain and that you're all learning together so uh, start with your comfort level and then kind of push yourself i think rule of thumb yeah sandy Hello, we can hear you, Sandy. Hey, yeah, sorry, press the okay. wrong button. Um, I agree with Karen. I think I also mentioned in my slide, the most important thing is that educators need to be comfortable with what they're happy in using, because if they're comfortable, the students will naturally see that they can work on it. Wow. Yeah. That, that, so that that's a very good one so ease of use use something that you're comfortable with it's very very important uh when you're considering a virtual learning environment 